Intersusception. What is that? Intersusception is an interesting disorder which affects uh, children typically between three months and three years of age in which the bowel telescopes on itself. Uh, the upper piece of bowel thinks the lower piece of bowel is a piece of food and eats it. And much like an antenna, it folds in on itself. The problem is, is that not only does the bowel accordion in on itself, it draws in the mesentery, which carries the blood supply to the bowel. And so eventually, over time, the blood supply to the lower segment of bowel was compromised, and the bowel can actually die. So in other words, it's a emergency you don't sit at. And usually you look at a kid that has vomiting and abdominal distension. It's the characteristic. Yes, typically the child, uh, the parents will notice, uh, has crampy, intermittent belly pain. It will be episodic with periods in between where the child is lethargic or just not in pain. At times, if the disease progresses, the child can be seen to be passing bloody stool or dark red stool. Red gelatinous stool. Are sometimes they're called radiologists then to fix it. Is that possible? Yes. The type of intersusception we're talking about is one in which the small intestines passes into the large intestines. The radiologist can help to make the diagnosis with an ultrasound, which is very sensitive for picking up the disorder. He can also cure the disease by passing a tube into the rectum and doing an enema while he watches on a video screen. He can not only see the intussusception, but he can see it as he forces it backward and hopefully completely reduces it. Uh, if he's not or she's not successful, there has to be a serious ready to operate, is that true? Correct. So it's a partnership. Absolutely. We work very closely with our uh, radiology uh, colleagues. Um, if they are incapable of reducing the intersusception, despite trying at least three times, which is typical, we rush the child to the operating room and we will then manually try to reduce the intersusception. At times, however, we're also unsuccessful. If we can't reduce the intersusception, it indicates that the segment of bowel which is intussuscepted, is in all likelihood dead. At that point, we reset that segment and put the intestines back together. And they usually people do quite well after that. They do extremely well.